Hi everybody, my name is Chris from Reading Town and thank you for joining us today for Junior Times. Now today, we're going to talk about a company that you may very well know, Microsoft, right? The president is Bill Gates, or it used to be Bill Gates. It was created by Bill Gates and this company, Microsoft, gets LinkedIn, meaning they will buy it for a large amount of money. So, uh, LinkedIn is a company and Microsoft will buy this company and it will become Microsoft. Have you ever purchased or bought something with money? Something for $26.2 billion or 30.7 trillion won. Trillion is 12 zeros, right? So we're gonna say 30 plus 12 zeros of one that's how much Microsoft will pay to purchase or to buy the long time professional network LinkedIn. So LinkedIn is, a, is like a networking site. It's kind of like Facebook, right? It's not a social networking site where people want to make friends and share pictures. It's a professional network site. So people who have jobs like doctors and teachers, and other workers, they want to find work or find a job in a company in Samsung and all these companies, they use LinkedIn. Okay, so Facebook is for fun, LinkedIn is for working. Microsoft Corporation, the software giant started by Bill Gates, plans to purchase LinkedIn by the end of the year. LinkedIn is a social networking site made for and used by professionals around the world. So professionals, again, we're not talking about, you know, professional baseball players, someone who's very good at baseball. We're talking about a worker. So if you are working and you get money at any job, you are called a professional, like an office worker or even a teacher or even a e-mart worker. They are a professional. LinkedIn and Microsoft may have some problems though, right? Like oil and water, there is some worry that the two companies will not mix together because of how different they are. So they give you sort of an, an image, this uh, analogy, oil and water, right? When we think about oil and water, it doesn't mix. And they're saying that these companies will not mix together just like that. Still, Microsoft believes that LinkedIn is important to their long-term business strategy for their future plans, right? 10 years later, their plan is important to have LinkedIn. This is not the first time Microsoft is buying a company. In 2011, Microsoft bought Skype, a video calling website for 8.5 billion or 9.9 .9 trillion. And in 2014, they also purchased Nokia, a mobile phone company for 7.2 billion, 8.4 trillion. I believe that Microsoft also bought Minecraft, that popular game that many of you like. Microsoft bought all these companies to create or to make new programs that will make working in the office easier. So Microsoft, they really want to buy companies that connect people, right? Skype, they connect people with video calling. Nokia, they connect people with phones. LinkedIn, they connect people with jobs, right? So that's their strategy. That is their plan, right? Strategy or plan. Uh, LinkedIn will tightly integrate or really connect into Office uh, Office is the program that we use on the computer, like Microsoft Word, we type. And so this is just a computer program that almost every office in the world uses. Enabling or letting users to have a more seamless experience. So again, in regular uh, Office program, we have to open one program to do the typing and open a different program to call. We have to use our tablet to do drawing. But he wants to do a seamless experience, meaning they're all connected. We can do all of this in one program. We can call, we can draw, we can type, we can talk, we can network, all in one seamless 
program. The company stated, right? Soon you'll be using Office and LinkedIn through the same app. So really they're just taking many programs and putting it into one application. Okay, we have three review questions here. What's LinkedIn? What is this program? It is a social blank site that allows professionals to connect with each other. So we have this, uh, we call Facebook in Korea SNS, right? Social N site. What does that N stand for? It is a networking. Networking means there's many people and we all bring it together and we are connecting them. We are networking them, right? B. What are some worries about Microsoft buying LinkedIn? They may not blank well together. So what's some future problems? They mentioned oil and water, right? Why did they talk about oil and water? Well, because they don't like to mix together, right? So that's the answer here. Just like oil and water, they may not mix together well. C. Why does Microsoft keep buying other companies like Skype and Nokia? Well, because Microsoft wants to blank new programs that will make working in the office easier. So they have many programs and they want to make a new one. One program that has all of these different sort of jobs. And another word to say make is to is to create. Creating is when we are making something from the beginning, right? All right. We have three key terms here. A, Microsoft believes that LinkedIn is important to their long-term business blank, right? So their long-term means in 50 years, in 100 years, right? What is their plan? What are they going to do? And another way to say plan is to say strategy. Uh, when you are in a baseball or soccer or basketball team, you have to make a plan. You have to make a strategy, right? B, this is not the blank time Microsoft is buying a company. Again, Microsoft bought Skype, they bought Nokia, they bought uh, all these other different companies. And so this is not the first time. They did it many times before, right? C. And in 2014, they also blank Nokia. So Nokia was a separate, different company. And Microsoft, they paid lots of money and they bought this company, right? But a different way to say bought is to purchase. So purchase is just saying buying something. You give money and then you, you get something. So to review, strategy is a plan or some sort of action that you are sort of making a plan for. And first is the opposite of last, right? We have the first day and the last day. And purchase is another way to say buying or bought something. So purchase, you purchase a candy at the store, you give money and then you purchase that candy with that money, all right? So I know 99% of you already have a computer at home and many of you probably already know many of Microsoft's programs and applications and you know, their sort of company. Um, so next time we'll see the long-term business plan, their strategy, let's all wait and see what will happen with Microsoft and LinkedIn. Will they mix together or will they not? Well, we just have to wait and see. All right, so thank you for joining us today for Junior Times. My name's Chris. I'll see you next time.